Hello everyone, my name is Ramu and I'm a product manager for Spatial and Graph. In today's video, I'm going to go over how to upload shapefiles into Spatial Studio. Shapefiles are a set of files and a very popular format for spatial datasets. There are many ways to upload shapefiles into Spatial Studio, but I will be showing you the most straightforward way to do this. So let's get started. Here we have the Spatial Studio landing page. We're going to click on Create Dataset and click on the File Upload tile, or we can also drag our file, just like I'm doing right now. And I am using a zip file. We can go ahead and click on Create, and Spatial Studio is going to process the collection of files in the zip file and upload them. After that, we will set our connection, and we can also change our table name and dataset name. When we're done, we can go ahead and click on Submit. We will repeat the process depending on the number of datasets we're uploading. And in this screen, you are also able to see a preview of our attributes in the dataset. Now that our datasets are uploaded, we might see a warning icon. We can go ahead and click on it and assign our dataset a key column. When we select our key, we can go ahead and validate it and then click on apply. This will make sure that it qualifies as a key column and then we'll do the same for all of the datasets that we've uploaded. A key column is basically an attribute that contains unique values, and let's say that our dataset didn't contain one, we can go ahead and click on Create Key Column, and it will generate a column for us. Let's click on the Action menu to create a project, and we'll be able to see our dataset under Datasets. We can add more datasets as needed, and the last step is just to drag and drop our datasets. In my case, I'm using police bounds and police points from South Africa. And this would be our end result. Now we can explore further in Spatial Studio and even combine our shapefile with other datasets for more analysis. I will be leaving some valuable Spatial Studio links in the description of this video, and I hope this video was helpful to you. Please reach out if you have any questions, and have a great day.